Hello and welcome to this Passion for Dancing video. My name is Leon and this is Kim and right now we're going to be teaching you the promenade rounds in the samba. This is a gold step, very fancy, very nice step. Uh, let's get to it. Let's do it to the count. And one, uh, two, three, uh, four, five, uh, six, seven, uh, eight. And another angle. And one, uh, two, three. Uh, four, five, uh, six, seven, uh, eight. All right, guys, let's do your steps now. So you're going to go forward, side, and forward. And then you're going to be turning around as you step forward, walk, turning. So go forward, walk, turning, side, forward. And then again, forward, side, forward. Forward, side, forward forward and then to end this we're going to do a whisk and you're done all right guys let's do your steps from another angle you're going to go forward side forward and then you're going to turn around forward walk turning side forward and again forward side forward and whisk to the side Let's zoom in into your feet, guys. I'm going to count it out. And one, uh, two, and three, uh, four, and five, uh, six, and seven, uh, eight. All right, ladies, let's do your steps now. So you're going to go back and side and forward and forward side, forward, and forward, walk, turning, side, forward, and then a whisk. And now let's do to the count, and one, ah, uh, two, and three, ah, uh, four, and five, ah, uh, six, and seven, ah, uh, eight. And let's zoom in into your feet, ladies. And one, uh, two, and three, uh, four, and five, uh, six, and seven, uh, eight. We're going to get you back to the video in just a second. Just wanted to say that if you want to learn more international style syllabus steps, you can visit our website at passionfordancing.com where we have over 150 videos showing you the exact steps and combinations in the international style as well as the American styles and more. So the lead and follow for the promenade runs is uh, all about getting around each other the right way. So let's show you what I mean. Um, so we're going to start over here. And now the first thing is that the ladies, you want to give the man a chance to get in front of you after the first three steps, okay? So Kim is going to go back, but she's also going slightly to the side, and she's doing kind of like a spiral action, and that's going to help me, uh, invite me to go ahead of her afterwards, okay? And she, she kind of wants to go back and to the side, and I just want to go forward, side, forward, as we cover in the steps. So let's watch that. And we want to connect here in the arm as well. So from here, we change the arm. My right goes underneath. She places arm, her arm on top of my uh, shoulder. Yes, yeah? so it's going to be one, uh, two. And you can see right now that I am in front, OK? There's a lot of other details here. We're just going to give you something to start with. But the main thing is, guys, you want to get in front on the first one. Ladies, you're slightly behind. Okay, and then from here, we're going to be changing places, okay? So my job now is to go around her, so I've got to make a really big step so that she can step in between my feet on the next step, on the fourth step. So right here, she steps in between my feet, and we get into this close position, and then I want to send her in front of me, or the ladies, you want to go in front, because you can see now she's in front and I'm behind, okay? This is super important, okay? So we don't want to end up like this in this uh, second promenade run. Now it's the lady's job now to get around me on the next step, okay? So she wants to do a really big step so that I can step in between her feet with my right foot. So again, here, and then we want to get into our uh, close position, changing positions, 
And then again, I need to get a head in front here. Okay, so every time we have one person uh, getting behind and the other one in front. So you need to kind of make sure that you're doing that. And then we're just finishing with the whisk, uh, just so that you can keep practicing it again if you need to. So we do a whisk, and then you can go right into it if you need to again, okay? So uh, let's show you one more time. So again, here we're gonna connect to each other, and I want to pass her, yes? And then from here, we're going to, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go around her. Ladies, you want to step in between the men's feet as we collect and change places. Now, she's the one that's in front of me. And then, again, she's going to go around me. So this is the hardest step right here is to get around uh, with, with, with the, or to the man's right side and so that I can step now in between her feet, collect, and now I get in front. Let's do another angle so you can see. So ladies, you're going to go back and slide to the side. Guys, you go forward in between her feet and get in front of her. Okay? So now I have to get around her on the next one. So I'm going to now uh, go forward and kind of turn, allowing her to step in between my feet, collecting her, and then letting her go in front. And we can even turn now. So we're at the wall. It doesn't matter. You can do the same thing turning around. Now she's got to get around me, and I'm going to step in between her feet. Allow me to get in front, and then we finish with a whisk. All right, now for some styling tips, and it all has to do with your arms here. So on that last step, which is a really a crusader walk for both men and women, we want to extend our arms forward and not behind our bodies. Let me show you what I mean. So I'm going to start here. One, a uh, Two. So right over here, you can see both my arm and Kim's arm, we're kind of forward, okay? Now we'll show it the wrong way, and that would be if we, take, if we get here, okay? So let's actually do another one wrong way, so we're going to get into it in the wrong way. See, this is like opening up. We'll go around. This is the wrong way. See, when it's going behind us, this is out of control. You know, sometimes you see people doing that. So you don't want to do that, okay? So that's the wrong version, what we just did. Now we're going to show you the right version. And that is when the arms are more like here, yes? Yeah? So they always stay kind of in front of your body, kind of like creating this V shape, okay? So let's try that the right way now. So we're going to go and one, uh, two. So you can see they're in front of us. Three, uh, four. Keep them in front of the body, okay? And again, five, uh, six, and then finishing with a whisk, seven, uh, eight. 